4.2 kilometers away. Eesh, that's too clean, bro. What's up, guys? It's Zigzag here. Welcome back to another GeoGuessr video. Today, you're going to be doing some skewed world attempts. You already know it's where you're looking away from the road, so it's really hard to get a lot of countries in a row. On the record sheet, the world record sits at 16 countries in a row only. The unofficial record, someone hasn't submitted a 20. So, obviously, we want to try and beat the 20, but even getting above 16 would be fine, and I'll see what we get on today's seats. Um, it's very seed dependent, this one, but you need good guesses as well. So this one feels like, it could be like Israel or Jordan, I think. Can't quite tell if we're in Trekker or not, because if we're in Trekker, it's probably Jordan, but if it's not, then it's probably Israel. Uh, maybe Turkey as well, but I kind of want to try Jordan, because I feel like I've seen similar coverage in Beirut. So not a country you get too much, and I'm fully prepared for this to be Israel as well, but we'll find out. Nice, so that's a really good start. Um, don't think I've ever had that round before, but I have seen that Trekker coverage. Uh, this one feels like Russia or Ukraine. Or, possibly actually Kyrgyzstan, because we see these massive mountains to our south here. So I think we're going to be around, could be Bishkek. Bishkek has the mountains to the south, not the north. So I think we could be in Bishkek area here. That would probably make the most sense out of anything. Obviously, we don't see any roof racks, but uh, I think they're just out of frame anyway. Uh, yeah, 22 kilometers away. So we're on a flying start to the video here. This one feels like maybe Bulgaria, I would say. Uh, the fact that we have a round, not... Um, a uh, square shaped uh, pole here is quite Bulgarian, I would say. The houses feel relatively Bulgarian as well. Winter coverage as well. Um, could this be Kyrgyzstan again? I don't think so. I think you would normally see the square variants of the poles, and it seems like we have multiple round ones in this round. Uh, as for the language, definitely all Cyrillic, definitely all Cyrillic, so that would fit for Bulgaria. They, they normally only use Cyrillic there. And uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna have to go for it now. Could be, could be Kyrgyzstan or maybe even Russia, but feeling pretty good about this with the winter coverage as well. I'm not really sure where to guess. I might just go kind of near the middle of the country. And ends up being 79 kilometers away, so that's a really nice guess. We're on track for 24,000 here if we uh, get some more decent rounds. This one, though, is a little harder. Interestingly, we have... Well, I thought it was bamboo. I think these two bushes are both made of bamboo. So that's interesting. The houses in the background kind of feel North American though. So I think it's actually USA maybe. Um, why those houses look so American it, it, and, and the fact that we have bamboo, why are those are together, I'm not quite sure. Could even be Canada, could be Canada for sure. But yeah, the bamboo is certainly strange. I mean, we have a wooden pole here with like a yellow sleeved um, kind of supporting wire there. So it's definitely, it's definitely something you see a lot in North America. I'm even thinking of Newfie here, Newfoundland. Um, we're, we're on a, like our, the river over here is to our east. Um, could we be in one of these towns over here? I'd really think we could be, you know? I'm not really sure. No, normally I get most of my rounds on this, on this coast here. So just trying to see if there's anything that looks like it could make sense. We also see those hills over to our east as well. So yeah, maybe, maybe Peterson's Pond or something like that. I don't know. It, the, the, uh, I could be completely wrong here because the, the houses and the bamboo are certainly contradicting one another, you could say. Uh, but yeah, feeling kind of better about Canada here. Um, could also be like uh, in Quebec as well, or New Brunswick or something like that. But I'm going to go for it. Man, ends up being USA there. So we lose our streak and our good score. That was a hard round. That was definitely a hard round. Uh, but let's see what we would have gotten on round five there. And it would have been a nice, easy career. So had we ra nailed round four, wow, and a really close guess too. Had we nailed round four, we could have gotten, so we got about 300 points on this round. So yeah, we could like, say say I knew the right region, man, it could have been like a 24.5, could have been, could have been record because look how close those other four guesses are. So uh, a really nice start to the video, all things considered. And we are on a one country streak. So let's just see uh, how we go here. Um, okay, so this one feels kind of, French or maybe even, I don't know, this architecture is kind of funny. It feels very Western European, but the rest of the round doesn't feel like French. I'm still going to go for France because I think it's most likely. Maybe Belgium even. Uh, no, it was France. That's good. That's good. Uh, this one is Asia. Looks like we have low cam here. You can see the, like the wider blur. So I was thinking it was between uh, Japan and South Korea. It ends up being Japan. Okay, so that's good. This one's another Japan, so we really like Japan on this game mode because whenever we see the low cam, it basically guarantees that we get the right round. Unless I somehow try to guess um, uh, Liechtenstein for 
for Switzerland. This language here feels Turkish, which is interesting because this manor didn't feel too Turkish to me, but then you can see kind of a dry landscape that's a bit hilly in the background. So yeah, I think it is just Turkey, which is which is good. Um, yeah, I, I should have guessed Ankara because that's where I thought it was. Um, not to worry though. Uh, this one's very generic Europe. I would say Poland or France or something like that. I think Poland is more likely. I think it looks kind of like a Polish round. Um, yeah, so yeah, the, the forest feels quite Polish. I, I like it best. I like it best. Let's we'll see. Yes, ends up being Poland. Wow, that was really nice. So we moved to our first five streak of the video. Very clean. Uh, let's see if we can uh, continue to build on that. Um, yeah, 16. Here we come, I guess. So this one is in Nigeria. Chart of the Countenance of Nigeria, it says there. Um, which city though? I'm not so sure. I think it's probably somewhere in Lagos or in the surrounding metro area. Might guess in this one over here, you know? I'm gonna go there. Let's see. Um, ends up just being in Lagos, so 19 kilometers away is fine. Obviously more than fine, it's good. Uh, this one is Gen 4. We got like short dashes here. So maybe this is Sweden. Didn't strike me as Swedish though. It's quite dry. Look at this uh, tree here as well. It looks like a dry climate tree to me. Hmm. So where would we be seeing these short dashes then? Uh, this this round is not really adding up. Could it be Spain? Occasionally get kind of short dashes in Spain as well. Or France. I think it's France or Spain here, but I feel like when they have dashes on the outside of French roads, they're normally a little longer. So maybe Spain it is. I don't know. The, the, the landscape fits for Spain, but it is a little, it is a little green. Greener than what you'd expect, but I'm pretty sure it's not. Hmm. I'm pretty sure it's not um, Sweden. Like uh, I couldn't, I couldn't completely rule it out, but the, the climate just doesn't feel quite right. So, France, Spain. No, it's definitely not Netherlands. Way too hilly for Netherlands. So yeah, I think it's between those two. I will go for Spain here. Prepared for it to be over the border. We'll see. Oof, what a clutch guess. That's great. We keep it alive. We're on seven now. Going clean. Going nice. This one feels very uh greek to me but it could also be um i guess it could be south africa it could be well the sun is to the south so we should be in northern hemisphere we can tell the sun's to the south because the shadow that's being cast here which means the sun must be in the south um italy is also possible italy is also possible i think it's greece though the uh the hills feel more so greek than italian could also be spain of course it could also also be spain but i feel like spain you'd have more dirt than grass well, that's 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 uh, obviously a massive generalization. You could easily have around like this in Spain as well. Uh, so where, I mean, yeah, just there's like this kind of vague hilliness is very common all over Greece. So I, I really do like it best. Let's see. Mm, yes, it's Greece. Let's go. Okay, we're actually on a contention streak here. This round is not too hard, I feel like. It's doable. The fact that there's no trees is helpful. Um, we kind of got dirt on the side of the road here. I think this one's Turkey. I think it's Turkey, could be like, well, could it be USA? Um, I don't really think it's USA. I, I just think like there's a little bit of litter on the ground here and it's just less common to see that kind of thing in the US and in Western countries in general. Um, where, what other possibilities are there here actually? Cause I feel like there are other legitimate possibilities. I'm just struggling to bring them to mind. I think Turkey's just easily most likely here. No trees at all, hmm. It could be like a weird Eastern Europe, could be a weird Eastern Europe, or a weird Russia. Although these rolling hills feel more Turkish than Russian for sure. This building here is strange, I could not really say uh, what exactly I think about it, but uh, yeah. Um, hmm. Okay then, I think I will go for Turkey here. Uh, last considerations, I don't think it's Middle Eastern, I don't think it's Tunisia, although that is... Uh, it, it would have to be way up here, it doesn't really feel quite right. Um, so yeah, I think the other, the only other big possibility is like US or Russia. Um, but as I look at it, I just somewhat prefer, uh, Turkey to US. I think that's really the, where, what it comes down to. So let's go for Turkey here. And wow, it was Romania. Yeah, Eastern Europe was always the other possibility there. So a really nice streak there. Let's continue it on though. Okay, next one here is looking to be USA. I would say Canada is also a possibility. No front plates on that car there. So maybe I actually do prefer can No, I think I think looking at this house over here feels quite US. So I'm going to go for that. Ends up being in Arkansas. Let's go. Nice. A nice little state guess there. And this one looks almost Asian. But I think it should actually be Europe. The, the moss on this like uh, ditch here looks quite Asian. Um, almost like I almost considered Singapore here, like a rural Singapore round. But 
I think I actually prefer like Britain or Ireland. Um, so maybe UK, maybe UK. Let's try that. Mm, man, it wasn't near Venice there in Treviso. So no, no good there. No good there. That's okay. Next one is US, I would say. Yeah, looks, looks, every, everything checks out for USA here, I think. Tennessee ends up being in Mississippi. This one looks South African. Or maybe even Brazilian, I'm not too sure. A lot of these, like, supported polls do still remind me of South Africa and then the separated houses. So, I think I'm just going to go Pretoria area here. Ends up being, yeah, around there, not too bad. And this one, I think it's low cam, so I'm just going to go for uh, Switzerland. No need to dwell on it too long. Ends up being correct. Um, This one is more interesting. I think it might be Mongolia. It's very hazy coverage, which I'm not familiar with, to be honest. But uh, th this soil color, as well as the flat, as well as the flatness and desolateness, um, would point me this direction. Maybe somewhere out this way here. We'll find out. I mean, it ends up being a good guess. I mean, not 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 too close, but also the right country, which is fantastic. Rock walls here, so I think maybe Yucatan Peninsula in Mexico. Also, could just be somewhere in Brazil. Um, Yucatan makes sense here, though. So I, I think I think I should really just go for that, shouldn't I? Yes, it was, it was. I got a little worried because I thought I saw some painted white at the bottom trees, but you can see that in Mexico too, so we finally get back to five, and let's uh, let's go for another here. See what we end up getting. Uh, this run's difficult. These, uh, this, just maybe behind my webcam or just below it, you can, I can see a pole top here, which looks quite Baltic, and I'm thinking it is a... It's either Estonian or Latvian, I'm not sure. We don't see lots of little blurs, which you sometimes see in Latvia. Hmm. Yeah, it's Estonian or Latvian. I'm just trying to think. The, 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 the landscape is a little bit more rolling hills, which you do see like along the Russian border in the in the Baltics. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I... Well, it, it definitely gives me both vibes, so I'm not really sure what to go for here. Maybe, maybe just, maybe just Lithuania. I think that makes the most sense. Ends up being Lithuania indeed, so that's fantastic. Uh, and the next one is Australia. And I think it's going to be that similar kind of uh, Western Australian coverage that we were talking about now. Yep, 97 kilometers away. Okay, this one is tough. It is Colombia or Mexico or Brazil. Maybe even Ecuador or something. We've got a cactus here, which is interesting. Hmm. Where to go? I think... I think I actually prefer Colombia here, but in the north. But, yeah could easily be Mexico. Those 50-50s those really do give me trouble. So if anyone's got any good tips, I would be happily, uh, would happily take them. But I think this area probably makes the most sense. The fact that it's a bit of rolling landscape may fit better for like Brazil or Mexico, but I don't know, the, the, uh, the vegetation kind of reminds me of there. Hmm, maybe I'm, I'm thinking of switch changing my mind here, honestly. Could even be like Accra area, the more I look at it. Just because of this kind of like a, uh, the way there's like, just like kind of the odd trees jutting up. I actually prefer that. This might be silly. We'll see. Oh, nice. Great switch. Ends up being in Bahia. So completely wrong vibe, but we, we get the right country, which is all important. Ah, this one's interesting. Almost gives me a bit of an Australian vibe, but not immediately like in other rounds. I think it is Australia. Just maybe Queensland or something here. This, uh, this looks like a gum tree and... A lot of the other trees look like the type of ones that might grow in Australia as well. Uh, sun probably does appear to be more northern, but yeah, it's more or less midday, so you can't really tell. But I will go for Australia here. Ends up being correct, near Brisbane. Okay, fantastic. Mm, this one's like... This one's like Arge or Peru or Bolivia, one of the three. I don't think there's really any other country that's possible here. Maybe Chile, but not really. Um, okay, so... These hills are like very rolling and, and some of them are tall. Dirt road coverage as well. I actually think I may prefer like this region of Bolivia here. Like I don't think like the, the hills are more like kind of just like rounded as opposed to, yeah, you kind of see how, they, how they're rounded off here as opposed to the other two countries where they're more kind of abrupt, I feel like. Well, fully prepared for this to be either of the other countries. And the fact that it's dirt road coverage may indeed point more to uh, Arge, but I don't know. I don't know. How solidly is the sun to the south? Um, so sun's definitely to the south. Wait, sun's to the south. No, I don't think it is. I think I think it's more or less just midday again. So 
Uh, I don't know. Uh, also, clicking here, they have to be tall mountains, and well, these ones are decently tall. I'm not sure if it's tall enough. Around Sucre, maybe? If we're looking north, that could make sense. If we're like over here. I don't know. Um, just gotta go with my gut here. Bolivia set is my gut. Let's see. Oof. That's not good. That's why the mountains were so tall and it was winter coverage because we were in Kyrgyzstan. So, uh, completely tunnel vision there. Or obviously when you don't have the, uh, the roof racks, it makes it harder to know. This one looks to be Japan. We have like the cabbages, so maybe further north here. 4.2 kilometers away. Eesh. That's too clean, bro. Okay, okay, okay. This one definitely feels Brazilian with the red soil. Couldn't really see it being Australia or anything like that. So I'm just gonna go here. And something actually a pretty good guess by Brazil standards. And this one feels um, Italian maybe? Oh, the houses are kind of strange. Is this actually gen two? I think it is. So Italy, I don't, I don't, I actually have no idea for this one. Ends up being Italy, that's nice. Okay, we're good, we're good. This one's probably Canada with the winter coverage. Uh, yep, ends up being nice and close as well. And this one is probably Brazil or like Hawaii or something. I can't actually tell which of the two it would be. Probably just we'll stick with Brazil here, but unsure. Ends up being Brazil, great. I was uh, fully prepared for that to be wrong. This one, black and white. Um, that kind of signs here. I think it might be Ghana, you know? I think they sometimes, they occasionally do that in Ghana. So I'm going to go for it. Ends up being in, oh, in, in Nigeria. Okay, well, that is all the time I have for today. So guys, thank you very much for watching the video. Um, hope you guys enjoyed some of those streaks. There were some decent ones in there for sure. And I'll see you guys in a video very soon. I'm going to get that world record, but nine as the best for today is pretty solid, I think. So you're just gonna have to stay tuned. We're gonna streak them together and it's gonna be great. So guys, until then, goodbye, and I'll see you in the next video.